Okay, raising and lowering your high-low is a pretty simple operation. Uh, taking a look at the uh, lift system switches, you'll, three, you'll see three components. There's the master switch that controls power to the coach and also power to the lift system. There's the lift switch itself. And then lastly, there's the safety cable release. Uh, to raise your high-low, you'll select the switch for the master switch into the uh, raise and lower position, which in this case is the down position. That will energize your lift system switch. Uh, to raise the trailer, you simply push the up button on the lift system switch. Once you raise your trailer, it's important that you test the safety of the lock bar. And the way you do that is once the trailer is up, Without pulling on the safety, press the down button. The trailer should not move. If it does, then your safety is not engaging and it's time to consult a dealer to find out why. If the trailer doesn't move and uh, the, la the safety works, then push the up button again to take pressure off of the safety mechanism. To lower the trailer, the opposite is true. Uh, you leave the master switch in the lower position, but you lift the trailer off the lock bar and then you pull on the safety cable to release the safety and then you can press the down button and your trailer will begin going down. Now before you get into this operation, uh, it's, it's mandatory that you check your trailer inside and out for any obstructions that would be in the way of the operation of the trailer. For example, your countertops must be clear, your cabinet doors must be closed, the exterior of the trailer should be clear of any obstructions such as lawn chairs or things that you've left on the tongue and the bumper, the gas bottles windows and vents should be closed and when you do operate your lift system be sure you're sitting in the doorway and that nobody is inside the trailer during the operation uh, for the safety of yourself and others. In addition to closing your windows and your roof vents and clearing your counters two other precautions should be taken before you lower your trailer. If your trailer is equipped with a lounge model such as this one uh, be sure that the lounge is tipped forward before the trailer goes down. Additionally the faucet in your trailer should be the forward position as opposed to the side or backwards otherwise when the top comes down it will make contact and break your faucet. 